your overall uh, impressions of the scrimmage tonight? I liked it. I thought there was a good pace to it. That it had a much better feel of a real hockey game, especially from the get-go. I thought the first period was really good. I thought the pace was good. There was physical play. Um, I liked the fact that I thought we were on top of people. Um, yeah, I thought I, I was happy with a lot of things in the scrimmage. Hi, Dave. Obviously, with with uh, Mika not being here, you, you know, you, you, you plugged in uh, Howden and, and also Morgan Barron into that spot. Um, how did Howden help himself tonight? I mean, did, did you like what you saw from him? Did you like the things that he was able to do? Um, and how's that going to help him going forward? Yeah, I liked Howden's game. I thought Howden did a good job complimenting Buchnevich and Kreider. I both thought had really good nights. But I thought Howden was involved. I thought he was moving his feet. I thought he uh, was hard on pucks. I thought there was a lot of good things out of Brett's game. Who's standing out to you that maybe you weren't expecting at this point? Four days on the ice. Is there anybody that's jumped out at you? Um, no, there's been a bunch of guys. I thought Buchnevich, like I said, had a real good scrimmage tonight. Um, I thought Keandre Miller was really good tonight, too. Um, yeah, there was some, not one guy's really separating himself to that degree, uh, but those guys in particular I thought had really good nights tonight. The, uh, whichever team it was, A, B, uh, the one that gave up six goals, I mean, was that defensive lapses or did you see anything that, that bothered you there, especially with, you know, Tony and, and Truba working as a new pairing? Yeah, I thought just White, White did a really good job staying on top of them. Uh, I thought the White D as a core were very good. Um, and obviously a lot of a lot of blue guys had off nights. You don't lose a game like that 6-1 and and uh, I'd have a bunch of guys on the on your roster have good nights. So, you know, we'll do it again on uh, on Monday as of right now. Hey coach, uh, you mentioned Keandre. I'm just wondering the two weeks that he spent with you prior to the play in. Um, how much did that help him and have you seen growth from that two weeks to where he is now? Yeah, I'm sure that gave him a lot of confidence coming uh, into training camp this year. I thought he played with confidence in the bubble. Uh, we were we were disappointed we weren't able to bring him with us, but um, you know, I, right from the get-go when he got here last year, you could tell, well, this this guy's got a lot of things that you like, and obviously we drafted him high, and we thought of very highly of him when we took him, and he certainly hasn't disappointed, that's for sure. We'll stay on that theme, uh, Dave. What did you like particularly about his game? And, and look, this is a short camp. Um, is this kid playing his way into the lineup at this point? Yes, he is. He's the, you know, he just moves so well. He takes up so much space. He's got such a long reach. He closes on people quickly. His puck decisions have really, to me, have really been the surprise to all of us. We knew he was a, you know, he made some good decisions, but you know, to adapt as quickly as he has so far. And again, let's keep it keep it in check. It was bubble practices and now it's training camp, but um, he's certainly shown a lot of the things you look for in a defenseman. Yeah, David, I wanted to talk a little bit about the power play. Uh, you know, do you think that you're inclined to stick with the units mostly like what we saw last year, or is there a chance, you know, we talked a lot about the lefty shot, righty shot thing last year, that a guy like Alexi or Capo could end up on that first unit? Yeah, we're certainly going to start with what the uh, made us really good last year on the power play. But as you know, every coach will tell you, as the season evolves, um, you know, people's play will dictate where they end up. But you know, I think when you finish seventh in the NHL in, in power play and you've got all these guys back, I think, uh, I think it's the wise thing to do would be to start with that group together. Yeah, Dave, you, you mentioned, uh, I think it was yesterday, that you wanted to get a look at, at, you know, at Jacob and, and Tony and uh, you know, this, this is your first real look at him, I guess. It's not a preseason game. Um, you know, it's one scrimmage, but, you know, did, did you like it? I mean, the, the team gave up six goals. I mean, right. did, did they play okay? What, what happened? Yeah, I, 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 again, I'd, I'll have a much better feel after I watch the video, but on the surface, it wasn't a great night for anybody in the blue. So, um, again, I'll have a better feel for it tomorrow.